Broadcasting live worldwide. Good morning, everybody. In half faith, let it begin. Family, nation, hello. This is Angel, the host of Half Faith, Let It Begin. You can tell by my voice. I know you can. I'm excited. You know why I'm excited? Well, let me share with you. Because, ladies and gentlemen, today is Friday, March 10th, 2023. And you know what today is? It's the day after Angel's birthday celebration. Why are we celebrating my birthday today? Well, because everything is doing great. My mom is out of surgery as of yesterday. By the grace of God, let me just start off by saying praise the Lord. Hallelujah. She's doing well. I just got off the phone with her and looks like as long as everything goes well, she'll be home today. So now we can bring in a celebration. And what better way to close out the week than a power of prayer? Because have faith, let it begin. Power of Prayer Edition starts right now. Welcome to Have Faith. Let it begin. Here's your host, Angel Santana. Hey, Ariel, can you say have faith? Again. Let it begin? Again. Say have faith. Again. Let it begin. No, no. No? no? Okay. Hi, Noah. Noah. Hi, Noah. Hi, Noah. Hi, Noah. Hi, Noah. Hi, Noah. Happy birthday, Noah. Noah. Have faith. Let begin when it starts right now. Hello, everyone, and welcome to Friday, March 10th, 2023. Big shout outs to a friend that I used to always call on this day, Kelly. You're a good friend of mine. You'll always be a good dear friend of mine. We lost uh, connections many years ago, but I wanted to say happy birthday to you. I miss the days when I used to call you 50,000 times on this day. Happy birthday. Folks, I want to just start off by saying thank you for your thoughts and your prayers and your concerns to my mom. Lucy is, Santana is doing great. I just got off the phone with her and um, I, I got to tell you, I'm on cloud nine. It's my day off. Um, everybody's is doing well. And today's a big day. Um, I've got a huge event. I'm going to see Peter Pan with my niece, his final performance. And that's going to be awesome. So, Ariana, I'm excited to see you. I can't wait. Um, All right. So, listen. Power of Prayer Edition starts like this. Um, You know, (laughs) yesterday was hard. It was a hard day for me. I'm not going to lie. Not because it was my birthday and I was turning 45. Listen, it's a number. Age is a number, folks. And that, by the way, 45 is the new 20. But that's, you know, that's another episode. Um, I was nervous. Now, when I say I was nervous, I have faith. And I believed and knew that God would be there for my mom, would be there for the doctors, the nurses, and that all of her experience would be perfect. I knew that God was with all of us. But you just can't help it. It's your mom. You know, it's it's your parents. It's It's... It's the unknown and it's the waiting and um, things happen, you know, or can happen. But one of the most important things that you can do is, is rely on all of your brothers and sisters in Christ. And that's what I was able to do. I was able to channel everyone that wrote to us, you know, the Susans that, that called my mom and prayed with her over the phone, you know, um, the, my consistory, uh, uh, you know, people that would pray with my mom after church services on Sunday, you know, uh, Marianne and, uh, and, and Joe and, and my, my pastor, Jim, who constantly is, is, you know, checking on us and making sure that everything is okay, you know, for, um, for Edie that stopped at my mom's house the night before for Carol, Gar- Carol, uh, you know, that just, I always want to say Carol Garcia. I'm sorry, Carol. But for Carol that always uh, reaches out to us and thank you for your beautiful message, you know, for Dylan writing me and saying, hey, man, what amazing message. And then saying, I'm, I'm, I'm checking on your mom for Melody. <laughs> There's just no words for Melody. Melody is always going to have a special place in my heart. Um, I love her to the moon and back. And she also had words of wisdom for me, for Mansa and uh, for Jenny um, that we're praying for. And, that, and let me stop real quick. We want to pray for a young lady named Jenny. She's having results read, and um, we want to pray that her results come out uh, positive. You know, a positive light, not positive as in the results. I'm saying all negative, but a positive um, result for us to be happy and know that there's nothing wrong. Um, for Dr. Inelli and for Nick 
everybody that supported me and my my boss Sean and, and and everybody that just asked, "How's your mom? How's your mom?" You have no idea that what that does. That uplifts you. That empowers you. That brings so much energy. That's why the power of prayer is so important. That's why I say that a day without pa- prayer is a day without power. So let's do that together this morning in Jesus' name. Heavenly Father, we say thank you. We praise you, Lord, today on the good days and on the bad days. We thank you for all of you that wrote to us, that that, that called us. You know, my Aunt Madeline, who was the first, as always, to sing happy birthday to me, but also wanting to know how my mom was. I love you, Titi, to the moon and back. We want to just lift up in prayer all of our Half Faith Let It Begin family. We want to lift up our brothers and sisters, our nieces and nephews, our aunts and uncles, our cousins, our grandparents, and our parents. We lift up all the elders, all of the veterans. We lift up our military personnel, foreign and domestic. We lift up our firefighters and fire rescue, our EMTs and first responders, our police officers. We lift up our government officials. May they get along and figure something out to make this world a better place. Stop poking fingers at each other and start figuring out the problems. We lift up in prayer, Tammy. We lift it up and trust it in me to pray for her marriage. We pray for another TikToker last night who said she had lost her dog and that she was mourning his lo- her loss. We pray for Jenny, otherwise known as Panda. We pray that when she goes into the doctor's office, they say, you know what? couple things that came up but that's okay because she did share with us that there's some abnormalities but maybe whatever it is that it's treatable and fixable and nothing nothing bad we lift up in prayer our good friends that have faith let it begin we pray for chip that he continues to be inspired to get something moving in the right direction so that he can realize that he himself is going to find a new job and a new career and a new journey we lift up in prayer all of our half faith let it begin family members our listeners we thank you from the bottom of our hearts here at half faith let it begin for continuing to be there for us on the good days and on the bad days so we conclude with this god loves you god believes in you god trusts you and god's never going to leave your lot leave your side so remember to have faith and let it begin remember to be good to everyone to be trustworthy, to be honest, and to love one another equally. May God be with you. May he shine his light upon you and grant each and every single one of you peace on earth. And never forget, have faith, let it begin. Take care. What are you doing on March 19th? Well, let me tell you what I'll be doing. I'll be live and in living color from First Reformed Church at 10 a.m. for a awesome sermon called Superhero, broadcasting simulcast on Facebook, Facebook Live, TikTok. And don't forget, coming up in August, First Reformed Church brings back Vacation Bible School, known as Stellar. God bless you. Have a great weekend. Woo!